Hello everyone, my name is Anton and today I'm going to show you something incredible. People always tended to explore and discover the world. Nowadays, billions of tourists reach popular destinations every year to visit famous landmarks. But what if I tell you that you may see amazing wonders not live in our country? Give me some time and I'll prove to you that Ukraine has some beautiful places you've never heard of. Ukraine is a marvelous country with a great tourism potential. There are so many beautiful destinations here. High mountains, spectacular waterfalls, warm sea, endless steppes and deep forests. I was lucky to be born in this country and see its beauty every day. But there are still lots of places to discover. I want to show you my top 5 places to visit. And the first destination is a romantic place in Klevan, Rivna region, which is called the Tunnel of Love. It is a 4 km long green corridor created by trees lined up in an arc with a railway in the middle. It is known for being a favorite place for couples to take walks. Local legend says that if you and your beloved come to the Tunnel of Love and sincerely make a wish, it will come true. Shepit waterfall in the Carpathians is not the biggest one in Ukraine, but it is definitely one of the most beautiful ones. It is located on the Polypets River at the bottom of Hemba mountain. The waterfall is 14 meters high. The best time to see it is in spring, when the snow melts, forming an intense and noisy stream of water. The next place in my list is well known to every Ukrainian, but it is still worth mentioning. I'm talking about Hoverla, the highest peak of the Ukrainian Carpathians. I'm sure that you should visit it at least once in a lifetime. The feeling of standing on the top of the world is one of the best you can ever experience and the views that open from that point are breathtaking. Another Carpathian landmark is Tustan. It used to be a medieval cliffside fortress city built on the rocks. Its remains are located in the Skola district of the Lviv region. Today it is a state history and cultural reserve and a popular travel destination that reminds of these distant events. And the last but not least tourist attraction is Bakota. It used to be a big city in the 13th century. Half a century ago, hundreds of families left their homes and farms there. The area had to be flooded to build a reservoir for a powerful hydroelectric power station on the Dniester River. Nowadays, the place is known for its incredible landscapes with still water and rocky shores. There are some really incredible places in our country. Sometimes it's even hard to believe that they can be in Ukraine while others look like they're from the other planet. It's great to know that you can still discover them. These places look fantastic, don't they? And all of them are hidden in our country. We're going to read four texts about these destinations. Your task is to match the pictures with the places described. And here's our first destination. Imagine that you appear in a place beyond time and space, without connection with the outer worlds, surrounded only by sparkling, miraculous arches, of magnificent beauty. This hidden treasure of Ukraine created by nature is called the Optimistic Cave. Unique in Europe and maybe in the whole world cave, it is not spoiled by civilization. Here you won't see thousands of tourists, overcrowded cafes and noisy transportation. The Optimistic Cave is the longest gypsum labyrinth in the world, a natural wonder. It is not fully explored yet. So far it is mapped 260 kilometers which makes it the longest gypsum cave in the world, listed in the Guinness World Records. There are almost no places like this left on Earth. The Optimistic Cave is a true miracle with huge colorful crystals, big galleries, narrow corridors and beautiful grottos. Since 2010, a giant labyrinth has been opened for tourists. Its picturesque and mysterious underground world makes this place unique for a wide variety of cave adventures. Did you know that Ukraine has its own Grand Canyon? It's a natural phenomenon which has no analogues in Europe. Oktava Canyon starts near Petropavlivka village and extends along the twisting channel of the Mertvovod river. It's one of the oldest lands of Eurasia, it ages approximately 4 billion years. The depth of the canyon reaches from 50 to 60 meters. The territory of the canyon embraces over 250 hectares with rich flora and fauna. You can bathe in small waterfalls with crystal clear water which is believed to have healing powers. Sometimes it feels like the place was never visited by humans. Majestic rocks, spreading trees, all look the same like a thousand years ago. 
The canyon is especially beautiful in autumn when the trees are covered with various warm colors. At sunrise, the canyon rock's color turns to peach pink, attracting lots of tourists and photographers. There is a place in Ukraine which looks like a picture from a sci-fi book. 100 kilometers from Kherson, near the village of Rihorivka, there is an unusual Lemurian lake, a unique pink oasis also called the Dead Sea of Ukraine. What makes it so unique? Even the history of its occurrence is surprising. In the 1970s, a military plane crashed into the place where Lemurian Lake is now. As a result of the explosion, an abyss with a diameter of about 40 meters was formed. After a while, the water of a strange color began to fill that spot. The lake contains more salt than the Dead Sea. This incredibly beautiful place differs from other lakes by its rich pink color. Today, scientists from around the world confirm that the Pink Lake has unique healing properties. Every year, this spot is visited by more and more tourists. Some just want to take unique photos on the shores of the Pink Lake, while others come to get well. Now look at the pictures again and match them with the texts. Let's check. So, Pachera Optimistichna is picture B. Aktova Canyon is picture A. Pink Lake Lemuria is picture C. Now look at the statements on the screen and decide if they are true or false. Pause the video to do it. Ready to check? 1. The Optimistic Cave is a very popular tourist attraction. False. It became available for visiting only in 2010 and it is not that popular yet. 2. The Optimistic Cave hasn't been fully explored yet. True. 3. Aktova Canyon is compared to the Grand Canyon in the USA. True. 4. The best time to see the beauty of the canyon is summer afternoons. False. It is perfect to see it at the sunrise and in autumn. 5. Lake Lemuria has the same area as the Dead Sea. False. It's significantly smaller, but much saltier. 6. This lake appeared 5,000 years ago. False. The lake appeared in the 1970s, so it's very new. Why do people visit all these places? To enjoy the views, to take beautiful pictures, to learn more about their country. When we express the purpose or intention of an action, we use the infinitive with to, meaning in order to. For example, he reached the peak of Haverla to enjoy a breathtaking view. Also, we use infinitives with to to express someone's opinion about something. For example, it is always a good idea to discover new destinations. We use bare infinitive, verbs without to, after auxiliaries. You should see this canyon. After verbs of perception like see, hear, he saw her jumped into the lake. After the verbs make and let, my parents let me go to the mountains next summer. Now let's do the task. There are six sentences on the screen. Complete them with the words from the box. Use two if needed. Pause the video to do it. Now it's time to check your answers. 1. Many tourists visit Bakuta to see its beautiful views. 2. Morning sun makes the cliffs turn pink. 3. It was unforgettable to swim under the waterfall. 4. All the people heard me scream in delight on the top of Haverla. 5. I promise you will remember that view forever. 6. People come to the Pink Lake to heal some diseases. Wow! What a wonderful country we live in! I have already added the optimistic cave to my list of places to visit. I will hope you've marked some destinations as well. So, don't be afraid of exploring the world. Start with your country. Be curious, be brave, and who knows, maybe you will be the one to discover some wonders on our planet. Till the next meeting! Bye!